Welcome to today's video. Today, how to draw convincing flipper clip characters uh, with a polished look using the uh, using the Sheps tool. So I'm gonna go ahead and call him Sheps, and I'm gonna go ahead and make this a little bit darker. Check create project. So we're going to be creating this character all the way from scratch. Now we're going to choose a pencil for sketching. And I want the color to be black. You see the size of the pencil is actually not bad. I'll put it down a little bit. Maybe 2.6. Yeah, that's good. So, I'm going to go ahead and start my character. It's going to be a simple character. Remember what I usually say guys, you have to draw big to start with. And then slowly but slowly you can put you can make them smaller as you like. You can adjust. You can adjust your drawings as you want. But first you wanna make sure you draw actually very big. So now I'm trying to come up with a character and I think it looks more like a cat. I didn't have a very big thing in my head, but let's make him more interesting. I'm gonna give him something to hold. Let me give him a guitar. Oops. So I think the guitar is gonna be around this way. And it can come out this way. It can go that way. Yeah, just a typical kind of guitar look. It doesn't have to be perfect, but you get it just for it. I'm gonna give it a guitar stick over here. Make this other thing here. Interesting shapes, big and small, in order for us to get a good dynamic of this character. So that looks kind of actually good. I like it. I'm gonna make this hand come over here to hold the guitar like he's really playing and feeling it. Uh, give him a hand to go this way. And let's connect here. So I draw Pokemon a lot and actually drawing Pokemon helps me uh, in my characters to give them a little bit of uh, an edge there. So I'm not going to give him this other foot, it's going to be covered by the guitar itself. And let me go ahead and give this guitar a circle here, just to indicate the strings. And the string tightening areas over here. So this is my sketch, kind of. And on this hand, let me give him a bit, a bit of the fingers there and the paws. And the paws, so he can be able to play guitar. Now, I did look up a reference of the guitar, so I'm just gonna go with the whip from my head. And I think that actually looks pretty good if I do that all myself. So we're gonna go over here, give him a little bit of detail. What I always say, the more details, the better. This is gonna cut in here. The more details, the better. I think I should make this one a little colored and leave this one white. But I'm gonna give him eyes closed, like those Buddhist eyes. As though he's meditating. Give him a cute button nose here. I hate that. I'm gonna make it a little pointed. So his mouth can come off of it. And he's a kitty cat, so of course we're gonna give him whiskish. Alright, so that's my sketch. So what I usually do is at this point, actually let me give him a little bit of a tail before we go there. Let it come off of him that way. Yeah, that's good. Give him a little bit of a platform to sit on. Give him a little bit of a platform to sit on. Give it a little bit more details. And that's it. 
show the direction of the light so that's our sketch guys thank you for watching this little short video and in the next video now i'm gonna be inking this and at the inking phase is when we're gonna use the ships to make sure we give him a polished clean look so thank you for watching and the next video should be playing soon